All right, welcome everyone. Let's make sure everything's working fine. Because, you know, yes, it does. All right, so chat ready, new version of the show. Uh, as this is going to be all tweak, no talk, which I am already sort of like infringing as I'm talking, but um, we're kicking off this new sort of season with um, a type of live stream that is probably going to be super cool. We're just gonna focus on mixing, which is weird because supposedly that's what we were gonna do before, but it's just gonna be more shutting up and more mixing rather than really explaining stuff. Obviously, if you have questions, you can type them in chat and I will try and reply to each one of you, but maybe more briefly and more multi-platinum somehow. Who knows, you know? So the first multi-platinum thing I'm doing is you're not really seeing me. You're only seeing my hands and the console one, fader and console one uh, knobs. That's how I call it. So both surfaces, keyboard, mouse, everything that matters is here because I thought you would like to see that. And maybe in the future I will add some kind of additional camera so that you can really know that this is me. But the first multi-platinum rule is you let somebody else do it and then you get your credits uh, anyway on the CD. So I thought this would be our first way to learn. Uh, you never know, you know, if that's gonna be me or not. It could be somebody else I put in charge of running these <laughs> this seminar, right on. So the session we have here is something coming from all the way back to 2008. This is a young teenager band that I produced. I think they won um, a contest through this EP. And one of the songs here is called Department 4. Uh, this Department 4 uh, track was part of their four track EP or five track EP. I think their single was called Grace. Uh, if I remember correctly, and I, I found the sessions in a hard drive and it was fantastic to reopen them. And um, I think it's the best session we could kick um, all Tweak No Talk with because it's really true, really true to how some sessions were done back in the days. And I'm going to comment sometimes on what we're going to do in it. One shortcut that I devised, thanks to Patrick, that it's one of my patrons, uh, my patrons that um, told me like, why don't you use the arranger track? Which is true. I went into Studio One keyboard shortcuts and I designed this go to next section and go to previous section. So, oh, hello there. Well met. Hello there and welcome. Take a seat in this uh, new version of supposedly all tweak, no talk. It's already a lot of talk, but you know, there has to be some educational value. I mean, it doesn't matter. So go to next section is control this, I have no idea, hypostrophe, and go to previous section is control this, semicolon. So when I do this, I'm just gonna shuffle through the different sections, and this is incredibly convenient when you're working this way, because when I'm working this way, I'm never gonna be able to really see a lot of, uh, a lot of, oh, hello there, hello dots. So um, I'm never gonna see exactly what, what we're doing. And I could even, you know, move the interface so that I get a glimpse on the top most part of the screen. I honestly don't really care. We're gonna figure out where we are. So, uh, so I've set up just a basic template that I have adapted to soft tube eyes. That's the term, uh, the session. There's only one limiter here, which is not soft tube. Sorry, that's my ML4000. I say mine, but it's not mine. Uh, just set to not destroy stuff. This is not meant to be limiting at all. So then there's a stream coming off to you. My monitoring is all wrong. Let me fiddle with that, it's out of camera, so. Oh, hey, Patrick, sorry. I keep forgetting the nicknames, but Twitch is great because you get to get to use gamer nicknames sometimes. So there's a lot of console one here. There's a lot of buses and stuff that we're not gonna use. A lot of effects, all of these blue things. So, um, you know, let's kick it off by just listening to this and enough with the talk already. So I'll probably just gonna play it back for you and then we're going to maybe start mixing. But I wanna know what this song was about, sort of. <laughs> Rex. 
Don't forget Drugs will please your mental health Right, I had a loop going on here. I told you this is gonna be great for all tweak no talk. Um, hear me out, there's no real volume work. Like the faders don't mean much at zero. I didn't track these uh, the way I would do later on. And I had to whip these teenagers morally, not physically, of course, uh, because these people were super young. So <laughs> uh, it, it is nice, it is nice. I propose I just drop all the faders and just go. So I'll eventually maybe comment on some of the stuff. Press play. I'm gonna go to the verse here and loop it and listen to some stuff. So we got a lot of work to do, and it's great that I'm not gonna talk. Maybe I'll stop eventually. Uh, because there's a lot of, you know, to make this sound multi-platinum, you know. Alright, here we go. All tweak, no talk. I <laughs> gotta love this guy. I had so much fun tracking this stuff and he couldn't give an F people to this session. You can tell that it's actually part of the vibe he has. Kind of like it. Okay, this one. Hypochondrix. Don't forget. Drugs will please your mental. All right, it's fun. <laughs> the lyrics, I don't even have to tell you. I love this band. I'm glad we won this, this contest because they were really good. They were a train wreck, trust me, but it was so good. All right, so first thing I kind of don't like is the kick. Um, kick phases out. I don't know why. Who tracked this crap? Yeah, no. No bueno. So, M drum replacer, people. You can keep typing, it's all tweak, no type. No, it's all tweak, no talk. So this is a really good thing. Let's try this. Uh, drum library, drum editor, no, drum library. Bear with me, this is real hard. I don't remember. Root, I want custom. Sampler, factory, custom. Where we go. Okay, it's a fantastic drum replacer but it needs to be way longer than I want. Uh, what are we gonna use? Man, I got so much stuff. I'm gonna use some Mark Mills. Thank you, Mark. Let's hear this. So we have to hear them, I, I assume.
down a lot. Maybe. All right, I like both, so we're gonna do a kick in. Can one really not talk? Maybe. Maybe. I'm gonna do a snare sample as well. Uh, but much better. Thanks, Mark Needham. Love you, man. So many good records. All right, let's put this guy here as well. Before console one, obviously. And I'm gonna use a different one. We could bother Fab, but maybe Quatza. Hold on, here, what is this? Ha. Well, maybe not. This comes from me not being used to. Doesn't really work. Let me try this, dude. I fear the I should auto gain this pal here. Okay, we got a face problem here. So this one's coming a bit too early. Also, I don't kind of like it so. Uh, let me get some fab stuff. Who knows? Oh! These I really like. But we are kind of phasing out. I mean, like the timing's not right. So we gotta we gotta go here. I don't know. I, don't know. I know why. Mm, all right. No, we're flaming. We're flaming. We're flaming. It happens with all the snares. Maybe, 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 maybe. I have to fit it. I don't even remember what we use for drums. Well, this is right. So it should be fine. Let's find out why this happened. Let me instantiate different. And drum. I think it calculates the feeling that it calculates the timing from where I instantiate that. So yeah, I can also yeah build the effects right, but this is nice. We got it, we got it. We got three now, that's pretty good. Um, what else, let's go back here. 
I fixed the drums. Hopefully. I don't want effects, I don't want nothing. I don't want nothing. And now it's gain stage time. I'm gonna make these drums awesome and then we're gonna take it from there. So first thing I'm gonna do is go and then I wanna go drive and we go straight to five. At least here. What's the maximum? 10, right, halfway through. SSL drive all the way. And also, you know what? I'm gonna dial in mix effects tape. Because yes. This is asking for trouble from how many tracks and things are going on here. All right. I don't have a preset, do I? So <laughs> awesome. All right, I like this tape. It's, I, I'm really worried about the crosstalk because I don't want that much detail stuff. But anyway, down with that. Something else, this dude here should be a hundred. Really low. That's why it was phasing out. It's very low. Phase is definitely correct. I don't want to use too much. I need very strong direct stuff because I'm gonna make it very loud. I like this. Maybe there's a tiny roomy thing here in the sample. Itself. Man, 
how, how did I get it that fast? Good. Now there's no bottom. I don't need anything else. Uh, I had. Boom. All right, now, overhead. Overheads, flip phase, we lose all the lows. Nice. Room. I'm much better when I don't talk. Let me let me check. All right. Keep talking about Formula One. Here's got work. Got multi platinum stuff to do here. These dudes gonna be surprised. So we got. All right. We haven't got the toms going. Right. But do I want to do the toms now? Do I have the energy for doing that? Where do they play? Here. Course one. All right, I see them. Man, I kinda hate though that I have to do. The floor play, I usually only trust the floor. This dude here. I wish I gave you more power. Maybe gonna be more power. So let me isolate this power here. You would like to really use a lot of solo. Ooh, oh, it wouldn't sound bad, but it's low. All right, it's got a lot of room. Problem with toms is that the loops you gotta set for these dudes here is insane. Sometimes.
never know that dream theater maybe okay i think it needs to got some compression works though how about drive <laughs> character I think it's fine. Uh, all right, I'm I'm super lazy, so what I'm gonna do is, nah, come on, we gotta do this with the right. All right, who's that pal here? Rock Tom. Rock. All right. Right, Rock Tom, right you are, here, pal, little bit of color. Rock Tom 1. Better already, am I touching the rock? Tom? Yes, I am. But the poor pal is... Oh yeah, go up. Like kind of a fast attack, cause right bell. Oh yeah, facing back. You know what? It's fine. And uh, lo and behold, beep rock tom. Got the same treatment. Well, the rock tom here and obviously it doesn't work. Nice. Need more character. Right, so got that stoner quality to it. Uh, symbols, who's that? These are fake, real fake symbols. And they're loud. Because the overdubs, like there's symbols already, but not that much. You know what? I'm kind of fine. Dark. Yes. Enough. All right. These I really like as a balance. A little bit of a dull snare. It's coming from the overheads, I think. Yes, it does come from the overhead. Gotta fix these because it's kind of nice, but I think it is the well, 40. We're recovering that with the shit. Come on, it's fine. Don't care. All right, so now I'm gonna make a layer of this though. So assign this pal here, and I want this. Up until here. No base. Oops. Something tells me that this dude has to go. All right. And now we check that all of these dudes here are assigned. They are, right? Yes. 
Right on. They light up blue. Beautiful. Also, I really like these LEDs things. Yeah. Yeah, 4000. It is 4000 E. Yeah. Now, bass. So I'm I'm really going old school with this. Like, you know, drums are done. It's supposed to be messy in here. Really like this. So I'm not gonna bring in any reverb, any additional stuff. I'm just gonna go bass for it. Bass is gonna be an issue because it's a horrible. We're gonna do it this way. A little bit of a guitar coming from somewhere. So we only have DI. So let's call our good friend here. Because with the DI, it's a little bit erratic. I want to use this power. Before. Definitely flip phase, people. The kick is completely different. Uh, and now, yes, now I can do this. I kind of like it. There's a muffly, muffly, muffly something about it that I don't quite like, but uh, part of multi-platinum is pretending that we like it. Right? So I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do this. Uh, but, so now we have a bass amp, but I wanna bring in bass amp room. And I'm gonna get that right after console one. Let's try and dial in a sound. Although I kind of like the DI. an empty uh, yeah, channel here to start with, with console one because otherwise it's just gonna
fucking how I like it. I'm the producer. I get to do whatever I want with this stuff. So that's cool. Now, uh, I'm actually gonna jump to voice. I know the guitars ain't gonna be a huge issue. I'm just removing all the mutes. As you can tell, I don't know if there's a global unmute and global stuff. So, uh, it's, yeah. Yeah, and some culture about it. It's true. It's kind of about that. So I'm just gonna jump here and I'm gonna use Mic Mod, people. Now, the mic we use is not here. I don't even wanna say what we used, but I wanna make it I wanna make it expensive. Let me hear this pal here. Azokistic Where Azokistic Where's all living? A fossilet department for <laughs> But it all fits the song so well. Oh god, that's, that's great. Uh, what else? So let me let me take a glimpse of this. There's no content. As okistic, where's all living? A fossil at department for hypochondrax. Don't forget right. Drugs will please your mental health <laughs> All right, so Azokistic Like this. Now what we're gonna do is We're going to go a long way with this pal here. We're gonna bring in a FET Compressor and I wonder maybe I should even bring it in before console one Just to get that last word But you know, this, this is kind of kind of a good bet okay. This I'm gonna do before Because it was tracked really clean and I don't quite like that Where's all living? A fossil at department for it's got no wheel to sing. Like a lot that it sounds like his mom said, like now you go and sing for Albert. As okistic where's all living. A fossil at department for So I'm going for super straight in your face, like heavy, 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 heavy. And I'm preparing it to have that kind of vibe. But I also want to add some reverberation and stuff. So what did I have here? Vox Dist, Vox Smash and Vox 1176. I actually Vox Dist should be here. And use kind of a different blue so that we know this panel. So actually spring reverb, fixed doubler. These come all from sort of an adapted template. Dynamite, I'm gonna use Zener, Germanium. Okay. So off with the Vox. As okistic, where's all living? A fossil at department. For it's kind of insane how I can't really hear it, and there's gotta be a reason. As where's all living? Yeah, all effects is completely wrong. Has to go here and was not muted. Okay, so now we have quite a lot of gain. As okistic. Right, awesome. As okistic. Where's all living? A fossil at the bar. Beautiful. Okay, these I like. Uh, Vox Dist head tape echoes. That's great as well. The faster I do this, the easier it will be 
That's really not what I wanted. Maybe this is different. No, okay, was right. It's just tuned wrong. Okay, go. Please, please go. As a steak weighs a living, a false department for right I and this is where the money comes from because when you manage to do this right it's just gonna be so good okay where's all living I fall sell it department for I think I'm gonna use also the Azokistic Where's a living A Fossilet Department No, now I see what I've done Tweaking the wrong thing Vox, where are you? Vox Dist, that's the dude This is supposed to be just Reverb, sort of Azokistic Oh, thank you. It is gentle vocals crunch. Where's my pre? Oh, there we go. That's my preset. This. Uh, okay. Okay. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Kept working on the Bronx. Uh, okay. Department for. I put on tracks. Don't forget. Drugs will please your mental health. As okistic way. This is incredibly important because it just makes the vocals phase in a great way. And it's super, super important that this happens. So I'm kind of happy. Uh, I don't think I want other stuff for now. Uh, whatever, no, what's gonna work and what's not gonna work. So I'm gonna go for guitars. Here, this. See how the vocals are even louder than we need? That's great. We don't wanna sync them. First change, compressor. I don't want the SSL, I want FET here. Thank you. Hear how the attack just makes the guitar position itself perfectly. So now we're gonna do the same thing. Load comp. Fat. Thank you. I'm gonna niche. Yeah, <laughs> this is a good sign. Means it sounds great. That's how the old people do it. <laughs>
this not saturating enough? Okay, okay, okay. Has to be obnoxious. Sorry. Has to be obnoxious. So fat is really saving us here. Fat compressor to me, in this case, because they were also tracked with some sort of not very cool mic. I don't even remember what we, I think it could be a 57, but to me, for some reason, it sounds like we had the amps too low. Sounds like some pitch control is needed. Uh, yeah, could be needed. But I'm not gonna bleach the guy. TLA 100, Tapeg is such a cool plugin, lux noise parameters. It's true, it has a lot of noise. All right, now, chorus guitars. Bring in the bass. Where's bass? Oh, these people here. Do it that way, because now we have a lot of bass, which I like. That we're gonna deal with that after. Same deal, fat comp. As you can see, Alberto doesn't know where. Maybe maybe I can load both of them together. Definitely I can. I know how to do it. Just I'll do it the old way, like you know, patch this for me, patch that for me. Why play on time, right? <laughs> so overrated. Four. Start always with the four to one that I thought would have. Kinda good, kinda good. Let's go here. Enough. It has to be crunchy in a specific way. Then there is even a solo here. When do these people play? Maybe next. I want to get the meat and potatoes down so that we can work. Ah, this dude here. This dude.
I don't know about that 1.7. Uh, usually. Man, the bail on the 4000 is spot on. 200 hertz low cut, pushing 7.7, 100. It just rebalances everything. <laughs> Okay, always my obnoxious guitar sound signature, but this pal here has to go to guitar delay because that's the only guitar we have. Uh, so I want it to be pillowing. <laughs> I think I'm gonna place it left and I'm gonna have the solo here. Right, but the delay, we're gonna put a console one on it. And when I do that, usually I like to have it here. Boom, next to it. So now when I select this, it's actually the last track here. Want to work on the solo, the lead as if it was a channel on my desk. gonna carve a place for the solo guitar right on I think around 6k whatever I have no idea maybe three we're gonna make room <laughs> right, we're ready I'm gonna place it in I'm actually gonna yeah let's do this Solo. These pals called G6. I have to call it solo because I'm gonna forget. On soft compression here. Let's go back to our comp uh, fat. Maybe I'm even gonna use a Mikey before. Try, I'm gonna try and make it come out of the mix without EQing that. And I'm gonna use the shaper just because it has that kind of pro. <laughs> could even attempt a weird setting. Maybe super fast and all that. <laughs> I love it. That's how I get comments on YouTube like, this song has 2.5, 7.7 kilohertz off and my room is perfectly so I was like, I know, it's the artist wanted it that way. They said it had to be obnoxious. You know, we make music to bother people. 
That's, you know, it's how multi-platinum people do. The actual multi-platinum effect that comes from the record being sold that much means a lot of people want to be bothered by that, you know? So get lost. <laughs> that would work. So now we have a lot of bass that's not going to work, like ever. But before we do that, uh, well, no, it's going to do that. We're gonna, we have to do this. Check missions. All right. Perfect. So bass, bass is gonna be cool. Bass is never gonna work now. It's probably either. I'm not gonna use one or the other. I'm gonna make a lot of fuss with this. I don't even wanna know if I wanna use the amp, honestly. I'm gonna put it down here. Uh, it has to work the way it is here. Let me, let me take the solo. It's actually a great spot for, for Alberto not having, what, what is that? Scratch pad, go away. So, what have I done? All right. Checking with undo, because there's so many things that I can make go wrong, if that makes sense. Awesomeness. Did we have bass? Nobody ever knows because... I'm surprised. This should not work the way it does. And because it does, we're gonna mess it up uh, for good. We're gonna go tube tech. We're gonna go Mikey actually before. So many things can go wrong with this guy. Then we're gonna go tube tech. Uh, CL1B. Boom. You see, you see them twice because I have DST3 and 2. It's so bothering. All right. So I met Leadcraft for the first time when I was at Dangerous Music and he passes by the booth at NAMM and he's like super pissed. And there is, and it's like, you know, uh, he stops by and says like, oh, there's a new compressor out here by Dangerous. What are you doing here, you know? And I was like, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm working here basically, but you know, everybody left and whatever. And he goes like, there's a freaking dude using my tube tech on snare. Why would he ever do it? Like, everybody knows it doesn't work. And he keeps using that, and all of his demos are on snare. So that's how I met Beatcraft. And I said, like, I know who you are. I was like, I don't care. <laughs> this is a great guy. Man, this thing. What do we do with it? Do we super compress it first just to get grab it? Maybe. <laughs> It's so angry now. Dave Dare. So awesome. You know what? You know what? Lil Freck afterwards. Because they're like, they're, they're really made for each other. Somehow. So after everything, we're gonna have the tube tech. But they're so... I became a master at aligning UIs. Right? <laughs> So good. This thing is so good. But I need a compressor on, which ah oh, it was already on, that's why it was so good. Um to compress a little
trust Leadcraft. I never, I never use this on fixed, like ever. Uh, but it just, it sounds so good now. It's doing a release that it's kind of a little bit too fast. And it's bringing the bass player beat up. Now the bass player was a young, young guy studying really hard with great teachers. And I remember he really wanted it, you know, to work and he loved his band. So, he, you know, giving him some sort of vibe. I think it's fine. It's also the solo. So I really like this. I feel like I, I would like to touch it more, but it's sounding the way I want it. So now I'm having issues. <laughs> This was without. This is without. You know what? Like tape. If there's one thing that works on bass and nobody uses it on is tape as much as they should. I'm gonna go maybe this. The moment I dropped it from, from C to B, made a lot of difference. I like it. All right. Me likes. Uh, I'm dangerously delaying the, the mix bus. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring in tape First, that's my setting here, just gonna engage. Taking out a lot of loads. I like it. I like it. It's a compromise. It's taking out a lot of stuff, but I like it. Uh, now I'm gonna do this trimming here, which is a plus 12 and minus 12. Let's go Chandler. Uh, this is kind of tuned on this record, so it, it won't work right off the bat, but you know, let's try this. <laughs> set these bands only to remember that I have to tweak them somehow. So that's the thing. I'm gonna put them all out and...
you see, if the if the bump is at plus, it it means that I have to check out how what to augment. And if it's on a minus, it's a reminder for me to go minus. So if, if it's on plus one, I'll go plus something. I don't know what, but I'll go plus something. If it's on minus something, I'll go minus something. It's just, <laughs> it's the worst way to explain it, but I'm not on camera, so that's not even me at the computer. It's, it's whoever I'm not paying to do this. <laughs> This is the most challenging band ever. Side content 1.8 or whatever. Nice, nice. I you, pff, I don't know. It sounds so good, the Chandler and that, and it's already in mid side and it works and it's calling for trouble. I don't care. Now, uh, it sounds like you're done, right? No, because I'm gonna do the chorus actually, third chorus, because I wanna do the backings. So I'm gonna kind of play a trick here, and I'm not gonna. See, this bass, it's a little bit different, so it would need to be a second kind of track, I think. Definitely. This is going to mess everything up. So, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna do not a bass sound. I'm gonna do disable. I'm gonna duplicate this. Complete. But, we're gonna cut everything. Actually, Boom, 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 boom. The beauty of sections. Ah, didn't do what I wanted. All right. Did I cut it off? Yes. So I just want to cut choruses. So no, no, yes, no. Cut it here. You can tell. I mean, there's a, there's a difference in volume. I think it's mostly the reason why I don't like it. Could be that. So maybe I'm only gonna gain stage it and it's gonna work. This goes here and this goes here. So choruses are down here. <laughs> that sounds completely different. Maybe he had a pedal. Trying to fix it just with the console, it's gonna be hard. Okay, okay, I like it. And 
then let's not forget we have this dude here. And this other guy here. nice I need to fix a little bit of I think I'm gonna leave the kick out it's insane I had the eye pass off The pedal he had added a lot of 300, so I'm going backwards on the 300 and it kind of sounds good now. Uh, cool, how about the brake though? Man, I mean, you couldn't really hear the kick, now you do. But, but, hear me out. Let's get all of these out. We need some reinforcement in the drum department. Oh no, actually here, let me take these out, go here. So I want to have some overheads. Okay. See how now the guitars are really pushing in and it's that's called mix bus compression changing our stuff <laughs> How's this possible? <laughs> Who's this pal? They're playing anyway. Why? That's interesting. Where's this guitar? Where are you? Manifest yourself. Is it G2? They shouldn't play, right? Or maybe they do. Maybe there's parallel. Oh, I don't care. I mean, it's fine, but they shouldn't play. They're muted. <laughs> That's pretty good. Do I have parallel going on? No. I wonder who's who's doing this. Well, these two tracks I can even destroy. Remove. Pretty good. All right, let's try and see this. Uh, just drums. Ah, <laughs> well, who, who, why, who's? Why is bass two playing this? Oh well, you are going to go. We don't need you. I can't, I, I can't believe. That's weird. That's weird. <laughs> that is weird. Maybe I shouldn't duplicate stuff. 
how, what, how do I do it now? Okay, okay. This is insane though. I have no idea why I'm hearing the bass. Uh, so bass should really be muted. Uh, is this a tr is is this real magic? I'm gonna write automation for this pal here. There's no no way. Like this is absolutely the first very first time this happens. But so I'm gonna write some auto here. Here. Boom. Should work, right? <laughs> Insane. So it, it doesn't need to be here, right? So, oh, nice. What? So, well, well, I mean, it works. Yeah, it needs to be right on there. That's insane, though. Not my fault. Can you believe it? 3.9. I think this was at 3.9, right? Because we didn't change your name. All right. Good. Generally speaking, I would like now a lead frack here or some kind of maybe tube eq let me let me think about i want to make some changes to the guitar bus uh this could be good now i want to use fat stuff though mm, okay tla i think something something that makes me oh you know what I'm gonna try lead frick. Boom. And we're gonna make a bus for it with germaniums. Or actually, I'm gonna put them up there. So let me open the germaniums because these are so good. All right? Good. This here. Period collapse. Boom. <laughs> This really works well on any kind of source. And it completely redefines the whole. This uh, very soft and very mixy, tax low stride like this. The problem is always the the whole output. They work, they work. I love these. They really redefined the whole um, 
balance of the lows, which are so important. I really love always to get some kind of 100 going on. So, all right, kind of cool. And now for the worst, worst of the worst vocals, uh, but in the chorus, chorus three, because I want to do this first. Spring the body. <laughs> So I'm gonna group them, probably. I'll make them easier. Let's go here. Body! Spring the body! Kill the money! Eat the daddy! Body! Spring the body! Here, I'm going to go group these three things, right? Actually, I'm gonna group them all, including one other bus, and I'm gonna go load. I think I'm gonna use effect compressor. Be super in your face and super. I had a thing here. Nice. And then a little freck, which I think I don't need. These are backing vocal stuff that I like to use. like it that way, I'm not gonna use this. Could use a touch of tape. I don't even know how much this is doing that sort of like interaction part. All right, so we said drums. Second compression only on the sample. Sounds really good. Third one was Transient Designer. want some brightness here. No. Gonna do a zener here in the drums. All drums we're gonna send to zener. Boom. quite make sense to send these to Zener, all of them.
but I'm gonna do it for some rooms and overheads maybe. That sounds quite good. Because we're also compressing the symbols quite a lot. It'll be too much, right? This one. So let's rebalance this part. Let's hear it in the verse. Let's department. All right, Who, who's who's this? <laughs> As a kiss, It doesn't make sense that we use him alone. We're just gonna stra extra compress him. such a blaze. Still too real, right? Still way too real. So I'm gonna use another fet just because I want more. And then Lil Freck. Uh, did we just Mikey here? Not on him. Let's just keep going. With such a blaze. Rolling class. Thanks for this gift. It's real play. These three dudes here also were gonna compress like crazy. We're gonna send them to. I had a, I had a bus for them. Boxes mesh. There we go. All of these backings. Boxes mesh. Boxes mesh. Ignorance is such a blaze. like to use but not in the settings I had so let me re reset what's what's the all right this dude <laughs> I think it's kind of too soft this pile here they need some more 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 in it could work as a as a bus. I don't think there's a lot of need. You know what? That's true. It's actually very true. So VC two A right before. I think it gives it a nice vibe.
actually in compressed mode. Right, and then set all the way. We're finding tuning these with just that. I like a bit of. Right, uh, more germanium. We can do it. Why not? Right. Uh, I'm gonna go as Zener. It's sounding a lot, a lot like too much, but maybe. may be mixed up. Okay, the problem of this is that the volume... <laughs> the dry is influenced by the other. Without using any sort of limiter from there, it's kind of like I really like this. So, all BGVs, no love. This is the chorus. Really now, the vibe of the lead obviously doesn't really work unless we start giving it some color. So, there needs to be tape here, and this I'm gonna do dedicated, maybe C. Um, I had a dynamite germ. Uh, I think I need a. I come sort of reverb. I haven't done reverbs for vocals here. So, artifacts and then artifacts. I'm gonna use that SAR anyway. We just need a tiny little bit of a delayed plate. I'm gonna keep this here and uh, maybe a delay. A uh, tube delay? Yes. Mixing VST three and two for added explosion. Sounds horrible by itself, but it's not what we need. We need. What did I call it? FX1? Oh man, horrible. It has to be. Very short. Department for. Masochistic 
Where's all living? Also. Right, okay, so I'm already delaying these. I need really need to. Take. Where's all living? I fall sail at the apartment for also, I hear it on the side, which is fantastic. It's not fully centered. All right, so now we, we got one guy that's singing over him. All right, now I see what's going on. Now these dudes are three and in chorus it's just the other three. So these I haven't really done. Now it makes sense. They're really, really full and they don't they, they don't sound like they should in terms of backings. Uh, they need to be a lot less important, right? So where's all living? I fall sail at the apartment for right. oh, okay. I mean we had like three three leads. Doesn't make sense. Okay, where's all living? Now we're gonna destroy these three with the fat compressors and a lot of fast. And I should align them and blah 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 and I don't want to. Where's all living? I fall sail at department for <laughs> hypochondracs. Don't forget. Okay, okay, that's much better. Who's this? Dude? Has to be obnoxious, of course. But now we deal with the rightmost. For don't forget drugs will please your mental because the whole approach of being mental health problematic is going to be the we can't keep them too open. See, it doesn't work. I'm using the shell. I put it all on one side so I can really do it. Kind of same treatment. For this is just the same thing, which sounds horrible by itself. And there's another guy here in backing three. I don't really think we need this here. I, <laughs> I think this is the mix effects doing this stuff, folks. What am I? I shouldn't be. <laughs> this is awesome. It shouldn't be like that. Absolutely not. Maybe it's a copy paste thing. Maybe it's a, these are chorus vocals. What if I take mix effects out? Aha. Oh wow, so it's crosstalk. 
This is a little bit too much, though. Azokistic Where's Eleven The beauty of it is now it's gonna mess the whole mix up. Azokistic Where's Eleven Nice, nice, this tree. Nice. More fat. If I can type it. More fat. Uh, these I'm actually gonna drive kinda hard. Just for these reasons. want to have a touch of these so that we grab the peaks. The backings need a lot of sort of like attention against these, but there is singing below the guitars and that's the whole thing. I'm gonna go tube delay on him. Uh, tube delay here. And go maybe wet, maybe not. Could be that, like the verse could should be different. I don't mind. Department. See? There. And these should really need to be aligned, like all of them. All of these three. Uh, we group them. Uh, verse. They really need the alignment. Like. So one would do this. I'm gonna I'm gonna actually write them. Hold on. This is faster because I have console one. Auto touch. It's these three people here, right? So Nice because the Vaders move. Uh, so let's do that again. So see, it works, and it's very nice because you can actually automate stuff for good. So this is pretty cool. So how does it start? Same thing here. I mean, we could put everything on touch and, and automate that. Obviously, this guitar starts off too strong. So one would do this touch. So. Maybe here. Yeah, maybe. Or maybe not. So maybe I do go like this to here. Well, I wrote it now. There's no coming back. Gotta touch it anyway. I think it's just a matter of doing this. Because we have no buffer here.
try and use these on the horse and just let's see what it works. So spring. Okay, fast. I think it's kind of so spring that bunny. Just to catch a little bit of that. So spring that bunny. Right, that could work for all three if they're on the same level. So spring that bunny. Spring that bunny. Kill the money. Yeah, I mean. Fat compressors, they kind of always work. Uh, if you're after attitude and stuff, right? So spring that body. Spring that body. Kill that body. I'm listening at very low volume, just so that I know where these dudes have to be. <laughs> I have no idea that these two folks were here. I'm listening at such a low volume that I was like, wait, what? But I'm gonna I'm gonna go with the floor. <laughs> I had honestly no idea these were here. Let me try this. I have no idea what these are. Let's do this and call it a day. Hold on. Run to tell them all what's your disease. Run to tell them all what's your disease. Let me put this guy here. This guy on the other side. Compress the heck out of them. Both of them go here. Oh, this has some EQ. Ah, no, that's seven. Run to tell them all. It was, it was right, right? It's seven and eight, so it's it's six and seven. All right, so this node needs to be all the way here. Oh my God, these are grouped. Let me go back to where I was before. All right, here. Run to tell them all what your disease. Ah, this is two two people together. Okay, okay, okay. Run to tell them all what your disease. Fix doubler. It's gonna be good. Let's try that. Run to tell them all what's your deed. Okay, 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 I like it. Uh, but wait, 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 wait. Run to tell them all what's your disease. Oh, the same dream. Run to tell them all what's your disease. Not even compress. Run to tell them all what's your disease. Z. Z. Okay, next one. Run to tell them all what. More of a vibe. Run to tell them all what's your disease. Could be that. Run to tell them all what's your disease. Be too much drive. Run to tell them all what's your disease. Wait, 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 wait. More verb. Way more again. I have no idea how it can come back together on the verse, but it does because of the tail. I think it's the compressors doing the right thing. So I'm just gonna call it a day and go F3 all the way down here. And I'm gonna take a look at the mat meter, goniometer, and Chandler, and we're gonna just adjust the magic final trick. Chorus two.
I like how it's missing some hits. <laughs> All right, let's keep that there and let's try the wise maximizer, which I actually know. Germanium. I'm gonna try and push it off the roof with these and then we're gone. We're gone. Then we're gone. Tape. Chandler, this dude here. After tape. Whatever happens, happens. This thing sounds so good. I think we're head there. Last chorus and then Koda. <laughs> All right, people. Thank you very much for being here in the first all tweak some talk version. Should be no talk, but it was some talk. Man, these plugins are amazing. And I think that you can't probably start as bad as I did. And the officiality of sound getting into the bold moves you make and you, I haven't tried to fight any problem or issue in the tracking. I've actually gone gone straight for it, straight for it. So loud and proud, and it still got the attitude that it needs for a young, super young punk rock stuff. So I, you know, they really sound great. If you just fine tune a little bit, things go a really long way. So thank you very much for being here. I hope you like what you've seen. And um, thank you very much. So off you go. Ciao.